Good morning, my friend. Namaste. So today I wanted to talk to you about uh, how do you go about preparing for your Samyama. So I'm sure if you landed on this video, you must be already aware that uh, this year Sadhguru is conducting uh, Samyama in December, starting from 13th of December until the 20th. And uh, there's a new batch uh, that's going to happen on uh, January 2024 starting from 6th of January until uh, 13th of January. So I'm sure you might have gone through the pre samema meet already because I'm recording this video on 9th of October 2023. So uh, I think uh, there are pre samema meets happening and uh, people are being guided in terms of, uh, you know, what the preparation steps are. So I'm not going to go into the technicalities of, uh, <clears throat> you know, what all you, you need to prepare. Uh, what I wanted to share in this video was more from the point of view of how I went about uh, preparing for my Samyama program and uh, what are the mistakes or what are the learnings that I have had, uh, you know, in my Samyama preparation. So I completed my Samyama in... Uh, uh, I think uh, February or January 2019 I'm not sure of the month but uh, you know I did it in 2019 batch and uh, there were around 3,500 to 4,000 people uh, present in, a, in our, in our Samyama program and I did it in uh, Isha Yoga Center uh, Koyambatore. So the current Samyama uh, that is happening in December 2023 uh, I think it's going to happen in English as well as in Tamil and uh, the January batch is going to happen in English. So I think there are certain uh, you know, basic elements that uh, we need to be aware of. The first and foremost thing is if you are somebody who has already registered for Samyama and uh, you haven't started yet, I would say that uh, you need to start preparing for your Samyama as soon as possible. You exactly have you know, somewhere around 60 to 65 days, uh, you know, starting today, which is 9th of October, 2023. So do not wait for it. Uh, Samema is a once in a lifetime opportunity for you uh, to be in the presence of Sadhguru for eight days. And uh, you can imagine if Sadhguru is spending eight days uh, with you, how much it means to him. And uh, that is the same level of depth that you also need to bring uh, you know, when it comes to preparing for Samyama. So I'm sure by the time, you know, you, you register and you have gone through the pre-Samyama meet, you are already aware that you should have done Inner Engineering, Shunya, Yoga Asnas, Surya Shakti or Surya Kriya, Bhava Spandana. But that is the technical qualification, right? That is the technical prerequisite in terms of uh, what should have, you, you should have already done. The more important aspect is, how seriously and how consciously you're gonna plan your next 60 days because uh, if you do not prepare well then samema is gonna be hell for you right <laughs> and i'm not saying this to <laughs> to scare you i'm literally telling you because what happens is the level of intensity that you get uh, you know when when you're participating in bhava spandana program you know, by doing physically intense processes, uh, you're going to get five times more intensity in a Samyama program uh, through non-physical processes, right? So as, as the name itself uh, says, right, uh, Samyama or, you know, some time ago, uh, Sadhguru used to call it silence program, which means everything happens in absolute silence. And... Uh, one of the prerequisites you know that uh, you need to imbibe as part of your <laughs> system is you need to start preparing and uh, you know learning to sit for prolonged period of sp periods of time so when i say prolonged start preparing for at least uh, uh, two to three hours because when you're gonna go there in the ashram in Coimbatore. Well, you may be required to sit for <laughs> hours and end throughout the day, you know, starting from maybe 4 a.m. in the morning until 10, 11. 
again we don't have the watches so i don't i don't clearly remember the schedule but again see the idea is not to make you feel intimidated the idea is uh, to let you know the seriousness that you need to bring to the table if you really want to experience uh, samvima in its uh, full depth and uh, intensity there's a huge potential you know that lies in in this entire samvima process or silence program and uh, as sadguru says uh, samvima is literally an introduction to the enlightenment and uh, this you know once once you've gone through the samvima program you realize that it's not just words sadguru really means it and uh, if you give your 100% you will be able to experience uh, you know that element of self realization and uh, unlike bhava spandana where wherein there is no particular process to be continued after the program in in case of samvima you do get a process that you can continue and uh, you can be happy and blissful for the rest of your life obviously provided uh, you know you keep doing your sadhana or you keep doing your practices so yeah uh, you know uh, the idea is you follow the technical aspect of the preparation you do all the relevant practices if you do all the practices it will take somewhere around uh, you know 5 to 6 hours every day <clears throat> so you need to organize your uh, daily events according to that make sure that you do not break the schedule make sure that you are committed and uh, there is obviously certain uh, diet that is re- recommended as much as it is possible for you try to do that but the central element is you need to start sitting for longer and longer periods of time that is the most important pre- prerequisite as per my understanding as per my experience right and uh, if you are able to sit through uh, you know longer hours i would say that uh, you will be able to sail through samyama uh, very very easily so i wish you all the best i hope that uh, the grace of the uh, grace of sadguru dawns upon you i hope that you are able to prepare uh, well for your samyama program and i hope that uh, you experience uh, you know the the full potential of what samyama is about uh i've already recorded a separate video on how my samyama experience has been so if you would wish to have a look at that i will link that on the video and i'll put the link on the description box as well until then uh this is kapil saying goodbye to you and uh, yeah once again all the best for your samyama program thank you very much